Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to Crowds Entertainment. Welcome back to the PDC Darts Tournament. As you can see, my I have no assistance level on this tournament going forward. But we are here for the UK Open in the very first round. We won the US Open. It was fairly easy. So I've decided for this tournament, we will have no assistance whatsoever. We're doing it all from our own back. Now, I did already start the game, unfortunately. And, and realised halfway through... I wasn't actually recording, so my bad. But as you can see, we are 2-1 up on the legs. I'm also sorry for the delay and how long it's taken me, me to get these out. Um, when I first started the Dart series with the US Open, I was very excited about it, got really into it, played it religiously for a while. And he looks exactly like us, wow. Um, but yeah, um, I have been very distracted for a very long time. I was doing other things i did other series i did I, I have a lot of stuff going on in my personal life at the moment and it, um, i think i'm just taking on too much at once but i've decided to finally get back into this finally start putting some more effort back into my videos because i have been neglecting them for a while now so i apologize i'm going to try and do better going forward oh oh, oh oh we've just missed a 140 there don't know if you can tell i know it's only early on but not sure if you can see the difference already in just how we're playing without the assist. It is a lot. It is, it is significantly harder, if I'm going to be honest, um, to continuously hit the highs. Quickly showing the stats, you guys, uh, for this first game against Michael. He's hit 180. I have not, but I am beating him on pretty much everything else. It's going quite well, um, I guess, but I think that we're really going to struggle in this tournament. In the US Open, we blew the competition away. Then we had a couple of tricky legs, a couple of tricky games overall. But it wasn't actually that hard to win. Um, when I kept saying, kept thinking as well. It really should be quite difficult, especially in the like, when you get to the quarters. Lost his concentration there. We're on a finish. Treble 20. Completely screw that up. That's a one, mate. It's so much harder without um, the assist. It's so much harder to get these spot on. To get them even slightly right. It's not easy at all. But we do get the treble 20 at the end. That's a good final dart. Leaves us with double top, of course. Michael himself is on a finisher. That's a great first dart. Very poor second, though. So we do now have a window. We do now have a window. Let's see if we can get double tops to win the first set. As you can see, my sense is a bit all over the shot, especially when you first jump into the game. We'll try and line the shot up just right. We're just underneath. That's not bad. Now, double 10. We were great at getting double 10 in the US Open. It's probably one of our favourite doubles. And uh, I don't think it's going to be the same for this one. We have just barely missed that, though, so not too bad. Let's try again. Perfectly placed. Well done. Double tens are still magic for us. They are still magic for us. Um, I'm not sure how many legs are in this one. I forgot to check. So here we go. We're going to go for it. 14 and double 20. Oh, no. That's, that's, I'm going to try and overshoot that. Oh, okay. Well, triple eight. Okay, we'll take that. We're still on the double 20 potential. So we'll try 18. Slap bang in the middle. Lovely. So go 4-1 up in the first round. Boom. No mistakes. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. The no assist. It is harder. You do have to keep your, um, your wrist straight, as in the real game. Your arm, your elbow locked. But, you know, they don't make it. This game is not easy to play with that assist. It really isn't. Even minimal assist makes a world of difference. Absolute world of difference. And oh my god, we are butchering this. 21. 41. Wow. That, yeah, I'd shake my head too, mate. That is... That, that, that was horrendous. We have got 340s, apparently. It's kind of hard to keep track when um, most of your darts just don't go where you want them to. Uh, and he actually did worse than us. I did not think that would be even be possible. Still, it's into the first... Round, we are the current US champion. 
going into the UK Open with huge potential. Got 160. Oh, got the 20. That's fine. At least they're all in the same area. 140. Get in, mate. Get in. Proof, proof that I can play without the assist. I don't need it, you know? But then again, a couple of good throws every now and then is not consistent enough. In order to be champion, you need to be consistent. You know, 5 1. Now, but it actually turns out it's the first six. So if we get this, we win. We've missed completely. But it is the first of six legs, and the that, that person advances to the next round. So we should have a, um, at least another six darts to do it because of how Michael is playing. Look how frustrated he's getting with himself. 41. Yeah. Three darts to hit double top. Our averages on the first dart are a lot higher than his. Not great, but a lot higher at least. First dart? Ah, okay. Second dart then. Second dart. Come on. And we've done it. We win. 6 1 is the final score. We do advance to the second round. Excellent stuff. Excellent stuff. See who we're going to find in the second round then of the UK Open. We have got Wayne Jones. That's just everyone else. There's still quite a lot of players left in the tournament. He is ranked number 30. We are ranked number 53. He should crush us. He should beat us. And without assist, again, like I said, we're going to find it a lot harder to hit the numbers we want, hit the highs we want, and avoid the lows. 401. So can we continue? We can. Ah, oh, beautiful. Straight there in the 60. Let's go again with another treble. Come on. Oh, we actually did it as well. Can we get a 180? The first 180 of the tournament. Oh, we do. Why is he shaking his head? We just hit 180. Yes. Perfect. Putting some real pressure on Jones now. I know it's only the first leg, but to get that first leg could be crucial. It could be the difference between us going through to the next round and us bailing out at the second. Which, after winning the US Open, I feel would be a bit... A bit premature, if I'm being honest. A bit premature. Ah, uh, this one's not going well. Oh, get that treble. Lovely. Lovely. We will take 100. That's pretty good so far. 100, 180, and another 100. That's pretty decent. I'm quite happy with how that's gone, this first leg. Especially how Jones is playing. I expected him to play better than he is. He seems to be struggling quite a fair bit. Right, treble 20. Looking pretty decent at getting those so far. But we, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's not going to work, is it? Right. We'll, stick, we'll try and get it now. There we go, lovely. Right. 16, then double top, I think. Make it nice and simple. Nice and easy for us. We've overshot that, and we hit the 8. Christ, Mark. Maybe got a bit too excited, maybe overpowered it because we thought, oh, it's at the bottom of the board. Who knows? It doesn't matter. We have a very strong finish in front of us. He is so far away from a finish. We have time. We can take our time. But this first leg should easily be ours. Oh, now we hit 16. Now we hit 16. So now we need double 16. Let's go for it. I don't think I've ever tried to get a double 16 in this game. But I have missed. I'm not far off, but I have missed. Boom! Straight in. 1-0 to us. Second leg. Again, we've played better. We played, Well, we've played better than him. Oh, we've missed the double 12. We'll go for a double 6. Jones is on a finish, but it is a quite a large one. It is a tricky one. We've only just missed the double 6 on that attempt. Yeah. Quite far off on that one. So Jones now has the chance to make it 1-1. But like I said, it's a tricky finish. Oh, no way. Trouble 20. Nice, good start. Ah, he screwed it. He screwed it up. Fine, it works for me. Now we have three darts to hit double six. And we go 2-0 up. And that should be all she wrote. A good 2-0 start. Really, really does uh, help our cause. 
Come on, line it up, line it up. Straight in. Boom, 2-0. Okay, so leg, th uh, leg three went about as badly as you could possibly think. I played poorly. I didn't get what I needed in anything. And that's case in point right there. Uh, we both got on to finishes and quite low finishes as well. And, well, neither of us were hitting it. None of, neither of us were hitting our mark. And I gave him so many opportunities, which I really shouldn't have done. I could have avoided it, but I didn't. And he ended up taking a leg back. So that became 2-1. I'm just going to go through the next couple of legs. Um, just to quickly just speed run through a lot of this, because a lot of it is a very similar situation. We have a few bad darts, a couple of good ones, nothing too exciting happens really. Um, we'll just get through it and see how we do. This leg's done a lot better. He's played poorly. I've managed to pull it back quite significantly. A couple of bad throws, but overall I've done fairly well. And I easily, easily take the fourth leg to make it 3-1. We're halfway there. So Jones played a little bit better in the, uh, the fifth leg. But still, he's still 3-1 down, and I'm about to make it 4. We make it 4-1. We are cruising to victory at this point. We had uh, one shoddy leg where we gave him way too many opportunities, and we couldn't close the deal. But we are now only two legs away from winning. He would need a, re well, a really big, significant boost in his performance. He's not played that consistently. He's not played that well, and he just can't seem to get it going. Double turn is needed to make it 5-1. It's our old reliable. It's the old faithful. It's the one we get more than we miss. But we have missed that first one. The second one, straight in. 5-1 up. Nice treble 20, double 20 to finish. Do it in style, mate. Come on, we'll do this in style. Miss. Alright, double 10. Old faithful. Again, we've crushed him this leg. No real um, competition, I'm afraid to say, from Jones. He's had one good leg. And the only reason he won that one is because I played so poorly. Like, bad, bad. I played really bad. But he is going to try and put the pressure on with a good, strong 100. Good score of 100 does put a little bit of pressure on me, but with double tens, nothing really stops me getting these. Not often anyway, unless I miss it myself. And thank God I missed that one, because any higher, that would have gone into the 15. Oh, we've missed it. We're on the double five. Oh, well, my word. Double five. Again, not something we get often. But we do get it at the first time of asking for double five. And we easily win 6-1. Another strong victory against Mr. Jones. We head into the third round. As you can see, we played so much better than he did. Uh, 1,300, 3, and 300, 840s respectively. He got four 140s, but he didn't get a single 180. Our averages on the first and third darts were so much better. So much better. So we do deserve to win that. So that's the second round. Sorry. Yes, the second round. Yes, done and done. Let's see who we're getting the third round, which will be in the next episode. We'll just skip through all the results. I'm not really that fussed on. Steve Hine, rank number 42. In Bolton, no less. James Wade, got Van der Voor, uh, John Park, Dennis Priestley. Okay. Adrian Lewis, a former world champion. Not at this stage, though. Not at this stage in his career, I don't think, but he, as of recording he is right guys i'll pause the video here because that's the end of what i've recorded ha <laughs> um thank you all for watching i hope you have enjoyed it and if you have dropped the video a like and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any more content we will be back very soon with the next round of this tournament i do hope you will join me for it let's see how i get on bye